Hi guys and assalamualaikum. Syed here from Box of Tech and welcome back for another video. So today we will be reviewing Apple's latest iPad which is the iPad Air Generation 4. Now, for the main specs of this iPad, it is actually really good for me for online classes. Now, talking of the main specs of this iPad, it is using an a Apple A14 Bionic chipset, which is this actually the same chipset that is used on the iPhone 12 series. iPhone 12 is really powerful, so it might be same as powerful as this iPad. And then it has a 10.9 inch backlit LED with multi-touch technology. And if I'm not mistaken, multi-touch was the technology that was launched since the first generation iPhone on 2007. You have the 12 megapixel camera at the rear, which can record up to 4K 60 FPS. And then here you have the 7 megapixel FaceTime HD camera, where you can record to uh, 1080p HD at 60 FPS. And yes, at least it still has a good camera. So if you need a spare camera or anything, you still can use this iPad with no problem. It comes with stereo speakers as it was said on the website. And yeah, basically this iPad comes in five colors, which is the green that I have right here, sky blue, rose gold, silver, and black. I mean, space gray. <laughs> And basically this iPad is really good for maybe for online classes. Now in the box you get the iPad itself. The 20 watt USB-C power adapter, which is same as the iPhone 12 power adapter, but yes, you get this in the box. A USB-C to USB-C cable, your manuals, that includes the quick start guide, Apple stickers, and also the warranty information. But if you get the cellular models, you i think you will get a sim ejector pin for the cellular uh ipads but if you like this one this is the wi-fi one so you do not really get a sim ejector inside and that is all inside so now let's see the ports and buttons now as you can see this is the ipad itself on the back you have these three pins for your smart keyboard you have your information the ipad text and the apple logo your 12 megapixel camera and also the microphone this doesn't have a flash as i can see here you have your stereo speakers and the usb type c port on the right side you do not have anything this is right side according to the back you do not have anything but maybe if you have your cellular you will have the sim tray on the left side you have your smart connector for your Apple Pencil. And yes, this is use, this uses the second generation I, uh, Apple Pencil. Here you have your up and down uh, volume rockers. On the top, you have your stereo speakers and also your power button that functions as a touch ID sensor. And on the front, you have your screen and also this seven megapixel HD FaceTime camera. Now, as you can see, the iPad is, I can see it's really solid built. As you can see, it uses an aluminum back and this glass right here. But yes, the iPad doesn't use a ceramic shield like the iPhone 12. And now we're gonna talk about what's not nice about this iPad Air. Now, as you can see, yes, it does have quad speakers. It has a USB Type-C port. But the problem is it doesn't have a headphone jack. So what you will need is this. This is a USB Type-C to 3.5 mm jack and USB-C port. So you're gonna put the adapter and put your 3.5 millimeter headphones inside the adapter like this. And yes, I think they have this in, at Apple. So maybe you can buy this separately. And at the other end, you can add your USB type C port like this. So now you can play games or maybe listen to music or maybe watch movies or anything. So in conclusion, this iPad is really good for maybe for your kids, for your brothers, or maybe for employees, for anyone that has online classes, 
who works online and maybe for content creators too due to this affordable ipad that has really great specs for the price that is offering now as for the price this ipad is going for 2599 ringgit for the wi-fi 64 gigabyte variant it comes in two variants which is 64 gigabytes and 256 gigabytes and also wi-fi and you can also get the wi-fi plus cellular and that is all from me thank you so much from what for watching please like share and subscribe and comment down below do you think this ipad air is good or maybe for uh people who work from home or school or home or maybe just do you like this ipad or not so see you guys again goodbye